Hello, welcome to next L Degustations session. And uh, this time I have another porter. Uh, this time it's uh, Week War Wessex Brewing Corporation Station Porter Premium Ebony Ale 6.1% ABV. It's a clear bottle. Ingredients water, malted barley, hops, and yeast. Ebony ale. Brewed at Wickwell Wessex Brewing Company, the old brewery station road, Wickwell Gloucestershire. Right, so station road. So maybe that's why it's station porter. Right, what else? Ah, right. Uh, the tale of the ghosty visitor. Hmm. Established in the 1800s, Wickwall Brewery is part of Wessex folklore. Stories about telling. Uh, told. No, wait a second. Stories abound telling tall tales of our beer and how it came into being. Take Station Porter, our premium ebony ale. They say that the ghost of Isambard Kingdom Brunel walks the old tracks of the Bristol and Gloucester Railway running alongside our brewery. Some say he's looking for the 1032 to Bristol Temple Meads. We like to think he's looking for the perfect pint of stout. We don't know the truth, but we do know that fables should be t told over a pint. Told stories from the tall glass. Hmm. It's the weak war way. Okay. Something interesting, you know. At least they, they have something to say on, on a... Uh, on the back, you know, not like others, nothing. <laughs> right, here's a, a plain black cup, but here's a clear bottle. And always when you have a clear bottle, you have to be aware that it can be a problem. It just depends how long the bottle was on the shelf, was it exposed to the sunlight, not so just prepare yourself for skunkiness no actually it's nice hoppy grassy a little bit earthy more grassy uh, what they they said they use three type of molds and fuggles. Yeah. Right. Let's pull it out. Yeah. Um, little bit like dark molds, little bit sweetish. Uh, some fruits. I would say red fruits. Yeah. Right, let's pull it out then. Right, is it ebony? Maybe you have a red flashes through the beer. It looks clear. Uh, so it's very dark brown. It's not jet black. Head, bash, small and medium bubbles, quite nice, big. Um, CO2, but some, some dry fruits as well. Quite pleasant aroma. Yeah. You know, just hints of richness. Yeah, right, so let's have a try. Nice. Mm. 
nice coffee bitterness it's quite strong uh, body medium dry there is some sweetness but it's mostly dry Uh, carbonation quite high because you can you can feel those you know biting bubbles on, on your uh, on your tongue yeah actually it's quite rich um, lots of coffee uh, little bit of licorice fruits dried fruits um, lots of uh, burnt bread especially in bitterness little bit of raisins little bit of um, What it can be? Black currant a little. It can be black currant a little bit. But mostly like, you know, fruits from the fruit cake. Caramelized. Little bit burnt. Uh, it's quite nice. Alcohol actually quite well hidden. Six point one. It's not so much, but in some beers, you can you can um, feel it straight away. Here yeah, it's masked by uh, you know coffiness, uh, burnt notes, some toasty notes as well, uh, breadiness. Uh, but like I said, it's mostly dry. And uh, body is rather medium, um, but Alma is quite quite nice, quite quite rich. And you can have this uh, uh, nice coffee bitterness as well. It's not so high, but it is there. But also, it is a residue of something staying too long, <clears throat> and it's quite a little bit chemical. Mm. But it's not very, you know, it's not very bad. It's not too long. It is long, but it disappears. So. It's okay. So it is quite gassy. Right. Maybe I will grab some more aromas in a glass. Let's have a look. Yeah, more licorice now. Now when it's a little bit warmer, it's more licorice. So it's quite pleasant actually for a porter. For this strength, it can be stout pot, huh? It's quite nice. Uh, it's nothing like, you know, wow, you know, best in the world, but it's decent. Uh, it's, you know, convincing. Quite easy drinking, um, so it's worth to try. Nice potter. So I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed this beer. It's quite nice. Please like it. Please subscribe my channel and cheers.